Let's get right to breaking news with the Spokane dive team and Marine Rescue spending two hours searching for a woman who allegedly slipped and fell into the Spokane River. But their search came up empty. KXLY force Tanya Dahl is live at Upriver Drive and North Haven where somebody called 911. Tanya. Well, Robin, right now the Spokane River is running fast, cold and furious and people living in a nearby apartment complex actually called 911 after spotting that woman fall into the river. No one has seen her since. And I saw a girl um, like middle aged uh, like up there and then go back down and then up again. Just before dark, the calls flooded 911. Eyewitnesses, including Theo Martlett, say they spotted a woman slip and tumble into the fast flowing Spokane River, struggling to fight against a strong current. She was up and my mom said, stay up lady. And then all of a sudden she was she was paddling like a little bit and then she stopped and then like, I don't know after that. Emergency responders grabbed their gear. A search boat team of divers in the Spokane County Sheriff's Office chopper scoured the shoreline along Upriver Drive. Police say after interviewing several people, the reports are credible. It looked like uh, they walked up there some plastic kind of leading down to the water. It looked like they slipped on the plastic and fell into the water. Uh, they said they could see the person in the water kind of bob up and down a little bit. Almost two hours later, the search and rescue efforts had to be called off because of the darkness, rain, and dangerous river conditions. We haven't, unfortunately, haven't been able to, to find anybody, so. For those who watched a woman struggle for her life, tonight's outcome was an eye opener. I don't like it. It scares me. So, they're so close to a river, any, anything can happen. And when we were out here, police couldn't confirm if the search would continue tomorrow morning, but they are warning the public this time of year with the river running so high, so quick, uh, so furious, it's best to keep away. Reporting live, Tanya Dahl, KXLY4, HD News.